there, I'll, I'll start with um, perhaps a design thinking methodology of empathizing with a student rather than providing yet another tool to the faculty, another platform, another learning management system, another plugin into the learning management system is empathizing with the student and understanding what is it that they're struggling with? What are the opportunities that we have to help the student out? Um, and think about designing an engaging experience. So technology is certainly part of it, but how does technology content uh, and even the story come together because when people say simulation, it, you know, the, the preconceived notion is this, it's a big complex thing, but it doesn't have to be. Simulation can be about content that's implemented, that's story-based, that's relevant, that the students will encounter when they enter the job market or things that may be relevant to what they're doing today. So how can we bring that into, as I said, a learning experience as opposed to, you know, let's build what the faculty wants us to build and put it in this new shiny box. And don't get me wrong, faculty and subject matter experts are still the core. And we always talk about innovating with the faculty as opposed to innovating to them. But in a lot of ways, I consider my job a success if I made faculty just a little bit nervous, right? What are we doing? How are we doing this? Can we do this? Then I think we're in the right track to build a new learning experience and put it in front of the student, validate that it really did solve a problem before we're putting it out there. And students didn't necessarily tell us that they want a text messaging tool or a mobile game to build uh, to, to learn medical terminology, but we knew that they were struggling with a communication barrier with faculty and they were nervous. We knew that uh, they're struggling with gaining as much knowledge from the lecture because they didn't have the prerequisite knowledge to enter that week one lecture. So starting with that empathy phase is I think is the key to designing that next generation model that will ultimately achieve that.